excited about what I'm seeing here on, uh, I'm poking around on the page. So <laughs> this is really cool stuff. It's really a lot of fun. I really yeah. enjoy, I, I'm sorry I missed out on the the uh, kickoff and the weekend chat. I was sick. So I, I just, I love uh, being a part of it. I finally was able to get started yesterday and do some, do some on this. So excellent yeah well, it looks like uh there were about 23 people over time and i tried to keep up with it but the ngs conference was last weekend oh and, yeah you know, i'm the awards chair and a board member and all that so i couldn't keep up with as much as i would have liked to but i've been catching up ever since i'm like <laughs> poking poking on different levers and you know what's this and what's that and yeah really fun yeah it looks like we got your uh, CC7 1000 Connections badge on your That's profile. A, yeah, there's I don't know like if you all saw this that. exciting stuff. I mean, <laughs> I I clearly, this has gotten me to dig in, which is the, the hope, I'm sure, because I had put up a minimal wiki tree and, yeah. you know, I just hadn't done much with it, just being busy and everything else. So this has really got me energized and excited and you know I know a lot of the people on the list that worked on my tree so I'm excited about that and I'm gonna poke around at what they contributed and yeah yeah so this is exciting yeah it's uh it's so much fun uh because um it's really interesting to see different ones that have uh specialities in different areas yeah you know that yes. come together and where all we go during the challenge, right. all the different locations, because yes. we're doing, you know, going out wide and getting all those collateral lines, which exactly. sometimes there's a lot of information to be found on those for the main lines. So yeah, 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 yeah it's really <laughs> exciting. It's really exciting. I mean, I'm seeing names that I don't even know who they are. So I've got to poke <laughs> through so I can figure out where did they come into the tree? I, you know, somebody married somebody, obviously, but <laughs> I don't recognize the surnames at all. And yeah, so I'm going to be poking on it for the rest of the day, I'm sure. Yeah. It, and like you were saying, uh, we, we've heard that so many times that professional genealogists, they don't have time to work on their own. Exactly. Genealogy, we don't. Right? <laughs> we don't. So. I, you know, we're doing it for other people. And we're learning along the way, of course, I'm going to be a lifelong learner till the day I draw last breath, but you know, it's like, learning from others too and having fresh eyes on it yeah you know definitely. people that have a perspective or know an area like I don't know Polish at all and um uh -huh. and minimally German you know I've done some research uh -huh. you know on some of the German lines and my husband has German lines but I've never had Pomeranian and you know and some of that handwriting is really hard to read and yeah so i'm just excited for what what this is all about so so well, we get started and other people will join us or what how does this yeah work? i think um i usually give people about five minutes about a couple of minutes past the okay. hour because okay. um it usually they, there's some that come in a little bit later or whatever so well we and it's them, lunchtime give them so, a little you know, bit of time yeah, yeah. depending <laughs> on what what time zone they're in or whatever so yeah yeah this is really exciting very exciting well and the another good thing about this too is that you know you get get this on there and get it growing and then other people can come in and connect or work right. on those lines you know we have right. the Pol Poland project that um will maybe take those a little bit further as time progresses so you'll be able to see you know and do you know different ones they fall down the rabbit hole and they'll continue <laughs> right. working on it even after the challenge ends. and so well isn't that the way it is I mean I know with some of the clients that I work with you know yeah they run out of money or whatever but I get so excited about either the region or the family story or whatever and then it's like oh they only paid me for x number of hours and I'm still going you know 
I, you know, and I give it to them. I, you know, it's just, it's one of these addictions that we all have, right? <laughs> yeah, you get, you get drawn into the story you do. of that, that yep, family you do. and it's, it's just oh, yeah. a lot of fun. It yeah. is, it's fun. It's just so fun. Yep. Well, here we go. Here's Celia. She's one of our, she's a, she's a, oh, oh one look of at our the helpers. Yeah. <laughs> She does a lot of work for us on does she? the challenges. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So she, awesome. You'll see her name pop up a lot. Yeah. She's having a problem with her computer hooking up, it looks like. Yeah. We've got the bounty points that got loaded just recently so that's exciting so explain that to me how does the bounty points work so um about midway uh aon adds like uh certain lines that we're gonna say if you add a parent to this person you get bounty points uh so we've picked seven and then um there are some of those might be ones that the guest has said is a brick wall and so those what we call them brick wall bounties and then um the discovery bounties the the 10 point yeah. bounties are for interesting finds hi celia hi celia love the cat picture <laughs> i'm a cat person <laughs> so they're they're just different opportunities throughout the week for uh the members to earn extra points and there's okay. actually like badges for uh bounty bounty uh, okay bounty gotcha. hunter <laughs> yeah well i love that i love the concept bounty hunter right help us break through walls and all that good stuff so yeah, yeah. mel gets bounty points this time well neither me nor mel claimed them so <laughs> yep the brick wall yeah, yeah this is exciting i you know i poked through and i saw melanie mccomb is on here and um, Michelle Chibnanko and Michelle actually was trying to help me with my Polish line so it looks like she worked on it a bit and yeah, um, yeah I mean some of the names are familiar so it's really kind of exciting yeah Michelle so we did Inky like is in Ohio I, or wait no Wichita Kansas yeah so she got on she actually won one of our NGS awards this oh, week. Oh, nice. So, yeah. Nice. So the fact that she even made time to get on, because she was <laughs> on the, you know, we, we had the whole conference was virtual and she was online when her award was announced. So the chat exploded with people. <laughs> oh, congratulations, Michelle. Well, this is cool, you know. So it's <laughs> neat that she was able to celebrate in that way i mean i prefer in-person celebrations but this is what the conference was so you know yeah nice very nice yeah so it looks like i'm just going to refresh this because um oh yeah there it just oh, jumped yeah, up again yeah so uh 1498 i think if we go to your profile let's see what it says Oh yeah. So it looks like I was 26 degrees from you when we first started. Now I'm only 17 degrees. 17. And, All right. And you're and through my French Canadian families. Yeah. Eighth cousins. So that's cool. Eighth cousins. That's cool. <laughs> that's cool. I think I'm, I'm something like, uh, I know are you now, too stealing through the French I, Canadians or which line? No, not through the French Canadian through, I'm always through like, through, I'm sorry but, but... Um, we're we're 23rd cousins so you know oh pretty distant yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> looks like greg is going to join us too yep. Greg clark yeah hi, hi greg hi there hi, i just greg. got back from, from cutting the grass so i'm a little <laughs> a little <messy. laughs> a little, a little sweaty huh yeah oh uh, yeah i probably yeah. have hair grass in my hair too oh well <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. You're dirtying your house, not ours, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, how are you, Judy? 
I'm I'm blessed. I'm but, but we're poking through here and looking um, at some of the connections and the profiles and bounty points that people got. And so yep. Excellent. I'm looking another, forward to seeing. Oh wow, look at that. Participant another, distances. Okay. Yeah, this is available uh at the top of the score sheet. Okay. Uh, distances here. This link. Okay, I'll look for that. Yeah, but I, I was telling and, uh, yeah, I was I was saying that I'm going to be poking through this probably for the rest of the day because I'm seeing surnames I've never seen before. I've got connections, you know. I yeah, this is just really exciting. Wow, this one changed eight degrees. Looks like wow. that's a pretty big drop. That is huge. Yeah, usually they'll be. Actually, it ends up being a big, not a. A big drop but a big climb if we find a common ancestor yeah but the big drops are rare mm -hmm. well that's that's always fun to see i'm, I'm just always suspecting that people are connecting to me through my french canadians because they're just so pervasive around north america <laughs> you know there's like yeah. so many of us so yeah yeah, do we uh, connect at all, Greg? Uh, I'm sure we are connection. We're connected. Uh, what, what's your? I have to grab grab your grab your ID. Twenty one. Nemer twenty one. Nemer twenty one. Nemer twenty one. Nimer. Okay. Nimer. That's pronounced yeah. Nimer. 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 Okay. Yeah. Didn't Nimer. you all learn phonetics in school? Come on. <laughs> not I, did, me, I did not they tried so hard to teach yeah. me it and it just did <laughs> it didn't not work, work for me. didn't um, attach didn't attach oh uh, yeah uh 17 degrees for you Eighth okay. okay go back then... go, go back i wanted to see which families oh no direct helps if i put in the right id here yeah yeah there you go Not eighth cousins with greg too okay let's Three. see who threw oh french canadians of course they're yeah. there oh wait but eighth cousins. more than yeah. one way 90 90 yeah. different common ancestors yes. oh god wow <laughs> okay yeah Oh, this is exciting. Well, and yeah. at least you're leading me around, you know, the platform because this is not a platform that I'm particularly familiar with. So mm -hmm. you're showing me a lot of different things to play around with today. Yeah, whenever you're on Easy so, to reveal. Whenever you're on, <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna just show you a profile I did. It's a World War II military profile that I did. He uh, earned a purple heart. Uh, this is one of your connections. Mine? So if you go to his... So this is one of the collateral families? Yeah, if you go to his, right here at the top, yeah. uh, the menu, you'll see his profile ID. Okay. And if you go connection to me, uh -huh. right now it's going to show you to me, but if you change it to right. your profile ID I see what ID you're saying. Here, okay. All right. Then awesome. it'll tell you how you're connected. Okay. Good. Good, good. So yeah, six I'll degrees play and six degrees. That's a connection finder, but then you can also there's a link here for relationship finder. Okay. So and we have really we have a uh, oh it helps. <laughs> I gotta change it here. <laughs> I keep forgetting to we do have that. a plug in, which is why ours will say at the top, it'll say what our relationship is. Okay. Um so it's your second cousin once removed. Mm -hmm. Oh, from my Pomeranian family. The Gaddies yeah. are Pomeranian. Okay. Yeah, this is this is the line I was working on. Is this okay? Um, I worked on the siblings of this gentleman. Okay. All right. Awesome. Great. Great. I added the siblings great, and the children of of him. So okay. Wonderful. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. the The cool thing about that Gaddy family, I posted about it in Facebook on the Pomeranian um, page. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And a guy living in that village took a picture of the birth home. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, I, you know, and it, I posted it on an afternoon, which over in Poland would have been in the middle of the night. 
but he must have found it then in the morning. And by the time I got up there, the picture was in my inbox. That's, That's amazing. amazing. It was like so fun. I, I, I swear by Facebook for making connections. I'm telling yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. This is cool. So he went a purple heart. God bless him. Yeah. So those are just some of the, the profiles. It, yeah. It, it, okay. It's been really great to see. Um, I didn't get a chance. I usually get a uh, try to go through and add the different locations that we went to yeah um before the wrap-up but i'll do that i'll be sure to do that before the um before the reveal yeah i was uh, gonna say so there's far, another date there's a reveal right yeah so, okay. yeah the reveal that will be live on youtube okay all right yeah but awesome. so far we have this is what we have um which i i think there's more than this but uh, th this is the location so far. That, yeah, it definitely uh, doesn't have the uh, um, the name name sick name sick family added. Yeah, location. Okay. So with um, we have uh, an additional tool that we're able to use called WikiTree Plus, which we can use to really delve into the database and nice. kind of yeah. gather some information. So sure, um, sure. I can go through and kind of get that information for you. Okay. Uh, add it to the space page. But, the okay. reveal will have lots of pretty pictures. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm looking yes. forward. I'll put that on my yeah. calendar to make sure I'm there for that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there should be on... Um, the email that I sent, I think I gave you the link for StreamYard. So you can just come right into StreamYard for the reveal. Okay. Nice. Okay. I'll so go look be... the email. Is it from you? The email? Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Yeah. So it looks like we've got 195 bounty points that were awarded and 898 profiles that were added. Wow. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I think, and like Amazing. I said, I think there's actually more bounty points because neither Mel nor I claimed for the brick wall that we broke yesterday. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. If if you can uh, let Eowyn know about those, just uh, tag yeah. her in the channel, then uh, we can get the, the score sheet updated. And what was the brick wall that you broke yesterday? Ooh. Um, it was the Bresna. Yeah. Bresna. Yeah, her family. Awesome. Oh yeah. So you her sharing... and the Moonsec family. Show her the fan chart. Just I was gonna say, it. show the fan chart that you shared in Discord. Okay, so I click on tree apps. I'm following what you're doing because I want to be able to recreate <laughs> stuff. It's recorded, <laughs> so you can come back and watch what she's doing. Oh, so. good. Okay, good. Yeah, um, and, and upload. we'll upload it to YouTube and I'll get you the Thank link you. for it. Okay, great. Thanks. Yeah, because I so won't remember all this. but <laughs> Just one, one of oh, the my... awesome tools that Greg has created for us. Thank you, Greg. Wow, You're that's welcome. cool. I love fan charts. Mm. There's, it's amazing. You can do all sorts of color coding. But yeah, yeah we added Andrew and Marianne's family. Oh, yeah, you can color, okay. color code by locations with the fan chart. That would be kind of cool. That would be cool, right? We haven't done Definitely that. We haven't done by that country or have something. Like using their national flags or something, you know, Poland's would be red and, you know, well, France you actually, would be you, blue. You can get to the point where you can fuss with what exact color you want them to display. I've done right. it in the past. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. This is but really see, exciting. Stanislaw yeah. and Marianne Brock and Antonia, Anthony and Anne. I don't know that Marianne and Anna are related. We didn't get back far enough to see that. Okay. It really they almost certainly are, but how well, close? Well, small I, villages we just, and exactly, yeah, Poland, right? Yeah. Okay. So it's all that blue portion that you added. Is that right, or a chunk of it? 
Yeah, it's the top layer of the blue portion there. If you go back another, right. I think we've got one more generation, one more generation. behind that. Yeah, okay. Wow. And some ancestors. Because this one, I've just had a tremendous difficulty getting through. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. And Joseph, yeah. yeah. So part of this part of part of my family, supposedly someone here, someone, some ones, plural, are Jewish. And um I didn't find up, any you didn't find any, any sign of that. They're okay. all they do come from the right area, but all right. of the records that we found were Roman Catholic. Okay. That's why a lot of the names are incredibly hard to tra translate because exactly they're using yeah. Polish. They're some Latin. records are Russian and all of the church records are Latin. Uh, um, right. And so, for example, I learned to recently that Wojciech is Albert. Is that right? Wow. Yep. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? <laughs> and then, uh, wow. What was it? Uh, Warencia. Wait, that Warencia made a little more sense. That's Lawrence. Right. That does make sense. Yeah. Right. Um, yeah. Some of Wojciech them do one, like, like make a... <laughs> You know, kind of obvious translation, but then the other yeah, ones. Yeah, Stanley like, and what? Stanislaw. Okay, got yeah. that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Wow, this is really exciting. Yeah, I. You know, I show up with uh, um, Ashkenazi Jewish DNA, so mm -hmm. if it's showing up, you know, that sort of classic. The DNA is, you know, five hundred years or less. You know, mm -hmm. sort of where the paper trail ends. It's like, okay, where are they going to come in at? Where's going on here? Huh. Yeah. And and were they pretending to be Catholic so that they weren't right? You know, killed, yeah. right? You know, so who knows? It's certainly possible. There was something a little weird. I can't remember. I remember looking at a record and thinking, that's kind of odd. Oh, somebody was somebody had a Yiddish version of their name. Okay, there's a clue right there. You certainly wouldn't be using that a lot. Oh, I know what it is. It's the Bresnan name is um is from Bresni. Um like it it actually it's that one is sort of a, a, a Yiddish version of the name. If I remember correctly, it, it you know means somebody from that that town, but it's a. Mm -hmm. And I was like, well, I don't know. It could be anything, really, but yeah, maybe okay. not. That's that's. But they all all the records. They all got married in Catholic churches, and they all got baptized in Catholic churches, and all that. Right. Which you know right. doesn't mean we don't know what they were doing at home, but right for mm -hmm. sure, yeah. for sure. Sort of that hiding in plain sight sort of thing. Right. Yeah. yeah. Right. Now that one, it looks like it's you've got two marriage oh, records, sorry. but you don't actually have a didn't have a baptism record for him. Yeah, some of them the uh I didn't do a lot of digging into most of these were we were lucky and there's somebody else's tree on family search. Right. Okay. So I didn't do so personal it digging that, into it. It's, yeah. Exactly. It's very possible that there are additional records mm -hmm. in that collection. Even. So, which is the name um, that's the Yiddish name you're referring to? Um, there's, a, there's, I think the Bresnan, B R Z E Z A. Okay. Is, oh, it's also, it Don't also gets fun here. because there's also the male and female versions of the names okay. um, oh. of the last names. But so that there's definitely a lot of, um, that's why the say all of the kids have different last names because some of them are uh you know like that the number three there. Yes. Uh -huh. the AJ. His, his name is Charles. Um in our it's I, I in couldn't the find Michigan him for a while. Records, probably. Yeah. No, yeah. But also in the Latin records, he's Carolus. Um, uh, Carol, right. ah, yeah, okay. Carl. yeah. yeah. Right. That makes sense. which I okay. did not remember to look right away. But his name is in WikiTree that way because they got his name off of his daughter's marriage record. So of okay. course she's list her mar or you know her maiden name would have been ending with the J, whereas his would have ended with an N. Oh, so this one um, just oh, to be so that's what how that worked. Okay, yeah. yeah. See, I'm trying to figure out. I don't know anything about naming patterns in that part of the world. So yeah, 
there's a lot to learn. Wow, thanks, Celia. Mm. But that's all, so just, you know, like, it can just be really fun looking. A lot of times the sis, like family search and whatnot, will know the naming patterns, even when we don't always. Right. And sometimes it's a surprise. And sometimes sure. they just got written down weirdly. Sure. Transcribed differently. Right. I mean, yeah. O and A and E can look yes. an awful lot alike in <laughs> cursive if you're not paying attention. Oh, For sure. Even an For S, sure. right? Yeah. For an A. Yeah, you got to pay yeah. attention to, you know, writing patterns, right? You got to go through other records and say, okay, this is a name I know. How did they write that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, it gets really confusing really fast. <laughs> yeah. Well, this whole, you know, so you can see on my, you know, my name, Nimer, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. It's actually but an Arabic name and it means oh. lion. <laughs> right mm -hmm. so nobody in my family is arabic and mm -hmm. it first was used in chicopee massachusetts when my grandfather just for whatever reasons not through a court or anything else just sort of changed his name and then when he shows up out of massachusetts he shows up in michigan that's the name he uses going forward until 1940 and then there's a court record that says they changes the name to Nimer from Nimyak just because it's more Americanized. It's yeah. an Arabic name. How is that, how is that Americanized? <laughs> and everybody mispronounces it, looks, it anyway, right? You it know? looks American. Yeah, I that suppose, was a, but... another fun bit was looking through all of the various different ways jo the rest of Joseph's siblings all. Yes. Everybody so had a different name Frank, spelling. Frank yeah. is Nemshack. Right. Um, and yep. Oh, yeah. And there were, the there were Catholic nuns in the group. And oh, a they whole had bunch different of them, names yep. as well. And, you know, so the <laughs> digging through all of these name variations, that's why certainly on some level, I haven't worked on whole parts of these family trees because I just get like my mind just freezes up like oh god I gotta do seven spelling variations. Oh, no. Actually, one of the well <laughs> again, but one of the ways we found Marianne's family is somebody else went from Chicopee to ah, to to Detroit as well. That's a classic pattern, right? Yeah, we find them tangentially because of somebody else doing something. Yeah. Yeah, this is marvelous, you guys. This is so cool. So did anybody work on the Scots at all? The Scottish parts of these families, the Walkers and the McCollums and any of those? Or was it mostly the Polish and the Germans? I saw I'm just the only reason we're doing Elliot. mostly that is because that's who I'm talking. That's what I did. Other people, Thank you. I think they did work on the other groups as well. Well, I saw at least one notation that I answered to um, because my Robert Elliot, my first Elliot ancestor, I think, in North America is actually um, the same ancestor of the current prime minister of Canada. Hmm. And so we've been corresponding because we've been trying to figure out where the heck they're from. Mm. And, you know, they've got more money and more, you know, availability to things than I do. So I kept hoping that they'd break it through. But what people have done on Family Search and, you know, a variety of other places is they've given him parentage that is not documented. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just sort of picking out of the air out of Scotland's people. Oh, this there was a Robert Elliot born in Scotland, <laughs> you know, around it the right time. It must be the same so, one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it must be the That's same the guy. same name. <laughs> yeah, so we refused a merge here mm -hmm. on WikiTree because somebody had put that parentage in. And so, you know, I just said, nope, it's not the same guy because we're going to attach these parents and it's not, there's my note, the yeah. search yeah. note. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -oh. yeah uh, when there's a common name like that, it's good to, I, I, what I've done before is take those Robert Elliot's in Scotland's people and just make like a, a chart and like go ahead and create them all and like right okay follow their life pattern you know out you exactly know. <laughs> right 
That's key. Vin oh, Finnegan, Finnegan's waving. telling me it's time to leave. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Bye, Greg. Bye, Greg. Yes. Nice meeting Great you. Great to see you, Judy. Thank you. Thank we'll you. see you next Thank week. You. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. Because if you can find like a death record for the different Robert Elliots, then, then you can, you know, go through, okay, it's not this one. It's not this one. He married right. this person. and Or this one so. stayed in Scotland. Therefore, yeah, he yeah. didn't come to North America. Yeah. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. And hello, Carol Lynn. I see that you came in. We didn't see you. We've been chattering away, <laughs> you can tell, right? So what else do you want to show me? Well, I think, I'm going to be poking all day. So needless. Yeah, to say. I think the rest will probably want to keep for the reveal. The reveal. Um, okay. Yeah. All right. to, Sounds to good. We want you to look properly surprised. What's that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we want you to look properly surprised in the reveal. Oh, please. Oh, my goodness. oh I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> I mean, there's so much here for me excited about already. If you're going to do more next week, oh, my gosh. <laughs> Can't wait. Can't wait. You guys, this is great. I am so excited. It was so great to, to chat with you. And well, again, thank I'm you sorry. for the time. And again, you know, I, I don't get to work on my own. So thank you to all of you who have done so much for me here. It was, it's been fun. I, I'm glad I finally was able to, to join in on the challenge. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is awesome. I, I'm looking forward to poking around and checking out all these new names that I have to learn now. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. All right. Well, thanks everybody for joining us and uh, stay tuned for the reveal that will be it's scheduled for, let's bring that up here, May 29th next at Thursday? noon. Yeah. So that's uh, yeah, next, next Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah. Exciting, exciting, exciting. I will be there. I can't wait to be further surprised. I'm already <laughs> loving the surprise I've got. <laughs> all right everybody have a great right. day and we'll see you next wednesday bye thank you all thank you bye-bye <laughs>